Hey, it's Hayden Smith at Smith Motor Company, and this is the 2025 Avid 21 FSX. I've got all the boxes opened up here for you so you can see everything as I do a little walk around for you. I'm going to read off some specs for you guys. We have a 69 inch bottom, 101 inch beam, and 27 inch sides, which is pretty high for a boat this style. Of course we have float pods and what makes this boat the T model is it is a actual tunnel hole. You have dual plugs at the back of the boat because you have that tunnel to allow water drainage on both sides. We put a hydraulic jack plate on all of these we order. If you have a tunnel hole you really need a hydraulic jack. Avid boats are all power matched Yamaha systems meaning you have Yamaha gauges and Yamaha rigging Gamekeeper edition on this one, which is the Mossy Oak package, giving you branded Mossy Oak camo and the saddle upholstery. Moving up into the boat. Console, really nice console. This one has the wireless phone charger holder. Really nice switch panel. This boat is equipped with the Garmin 93 SV, Yamaha gauges, seven person capacity sealed rod holders really nice little handle here on the side of the console tackle storage in the console which is super nice you can get all your common used baits in here so everything that you need to you know, grab and go quickly is available to you without digging at your tackle box you got bait well at the front it does use the max air intake system so what that does is allows air to be basically blown into the water that's being recirculated. So it oxygenates the water a lot better than the traditional live well system. Storage. Really nice rod box here. Clip out. Rod holder. Ice chest. Insulated fiberglass. Really nice. They even put a little piece of C deck on the lid for you to make it a little more insulated. Anchor storage in the front. I love this. By the way, this is not carpet. This is what they call spaghetti matting. So it just keeps it from rattling, but it's not gross. You can pull it out and wash it really easy. It's a rubber matting. This one is equipped with a Cherova AD iPilot. Trim at the bow. Moving to the back of the boat. What makes Avid's very unique for an aluminum boat is they put the fuel tanks in the floor, more like what you would see in a traditional fiberglass boat, which what that does is it gives you a walk around leaning post. So it's easy to access your live well here. Also, you can sit behind the wing post in rough water for your passenger. That's the driest, best riding spot in the boat. Let's go ahead and open this live well up. Very big, nice fiberglass live well. This one does have a light in it, by the way. It also uses the Max Air system. So the FST is made to be a very versatile boat. It's made to be able to run super shallow in the marsh but also able to take a little bit bigger water with those 27 inch sides. Really nice storage and leaning post, by the way. If you have any questions, my name is Hayden Smith, Smith Motor Company, 601-408-8898. That's Hayden Smith, 601-408-8898. By the way, this boat has about a 10 inch approximate draft and the boat weighs in just under 1,500 pounds for the whole. So you're talking about less than, probably way less than 3,000 loaded. You can pull this boat with really anything that can pull it with stability. Hayden Smith, 601-408-8898, smithmcmarine.com. If you have any questions, feel free to call me, shoot me a text. We'll take great care of you. Thanks for watching.